Hey guys, now I'm going to show you a progressive pitching drill that you can do all the way up to the mound. So first, you're going to get down on one knee, all right, and you're going to have your hands out front, okay, and you're going to turn your shoulders to the target. What's important here is to get your shoulders in line with the target that you're throwing to, okay? So you're going to work in steps. You're going to get your shoulders to the target. You're going to separate down and out. Make sure you're getting to a good throwing position with your glove out front. Pause there. After you pause there, you're going to pull snap and release the ball into the mat. Now you're going to do the same thing, except this time we're focused more on our follow through. So when you do throw, you're going to stand up and have a strong front side that you're throwing against. So for the third drill, we're going to focus on our weight distribution and separation. So here we're going to have our weight on our backside and our front toe pointed straight down. Okay. We don't want it pressed firmly into the ground. We want it lightly into the ground. So you're going to have your hands together. And as you start falling towards the plate, you're going to separate your hands as your front foot's going to the plate. So for our fourth and final drill before we get on the mound, uh, we're really going to focus on our balance point. So you're going to come set, you're going to come up to your lift, you want to feel your weight on the inside part of your back foot and relax front side when you lift. You want to feel it in your quad, you don't want to have a stiff front side here because you're going to fall off balance, okay? So you want to come up to a good balance point, weight on the inside part of your foot, separate, throw.